Hey there everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assist customers from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. One of the services that our customers most frequently ask us to perform is the SIM unlocking of a mobile device in order to be used with a different carrier or network other than the one that originally sold it. By default, most mobile devices these days are going to come with some sort of lock that restricts them to only being used with the original carrier or network, and they have to undergo some sort of unlock process in order to be used with a different compatible wireless carrier. Now, here with us today, we happen to have a Motorola Moto G Pure that is originally from TrackPhone here in the U.S., and this is a device that has not yet been SIM unlocked because with a different carrier SIM card inserted here, we have this message up at the top of the lock screen telling us that it is network locked. So we've been contacted by tons of customers over the years asking us for assistance with this specific issue on this specific model, usually either because they themselves wanted to change carriers away from TrackPhone before satisfying all of TrackPhone's requirements in order to do the SIM unlock for them, or the other common scenario that will happen a lot these days, unfortunately, is that someone will buy a used device from a dishonest seller who doesn't tell them that the device is still SIM locked. The seller will usually either claim that it's already been unlocked or that it's already eligible to be unlocked through the original carrier and they just have to contact them to have it done or whatever the case may be. But after the purchase, the buyer discovers that's not actually the case. The device is still locked. It's not eligible to be unlocked and they don't have any way to do it. And the seller has usually long since disappeared in that case since it's a very common scam that happens all the time these days in the buying and selling of used mobile devices. But we're making this video to let any interested customers know that we do offer a service to be able to get this device SIM unlocked without having to go directly through the original carrier, which is TrackPhone, and meet whatever requirements they may have in order to do it. So the procedure of unlocking it is actually something that we do directly to the device while it is plugged into a computer. And the great thing about this is that it's something that can be done for just about anyone anywhere in the world. So you don't necessarily need to be located here in our local area in order for us to be able to do this for you. You would just need to have a decently powerful Windows computer along with a fast internet connection connection and we can connect right to your computer through the internet and perform the exact same procedure that we're doing right here right now with this one. So, actually, as I've been speaking, I've been running our unlock program on the device that goes ahead and takes care of that for us. After just about another minute here, we should be able to see that the phone will restart, and then we will be able to see that it does not give us that network locked message anymore, and then it does get signal on the test SIM card that we have here inserted. So just hold on a second while it finishes up the last few steps here. Okay, so the unlock process should be finished now. We can go ahead and take a look at the lock screen here, and we can see up top that indeed it no longer says network locked. Right now it's just saying no service because it'll take a minute for the service to register on the SIM card that we have there inserted. So while we're waiting for that, I'm going to go ahead and jump into the settings just to show you exactly what we are working with. So when we go under About Phone we can indeed see that we have a Moto G Pure, and then the model number there, the XT2163DL, that is the specific model number of the track phone version of the Motorola Moto G Pure. Let me jump back to the network settings and just make sure that we are all set. Yep, sure enough. So under our network and internet, we can see that the mobile network now is set as Verizon, which is the SIM card that we have inserted here. So the device has now been SIM unlocked and is usable with any other compatible wireless carriers. So if you have one of these Moto G Pures from TrackPhone and need help getting it SIM unlocked, we would love to assist you with that. So go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact information will be right down in the video description, and I'll also put a slide at the end of the video that has all of the details there as well. While you're here, make sure to check out some of the other videos that we have on our channel, as we offer a lot of different services for a lot of different devices, and I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy someday. Hitting that subscribe button while you're there will enable you to be notified of all of the new videos and services that we're constantly adding and putting up, just like this one. Y para todos ustedes... 
Para todos ustedes hispanohablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes también nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks so much for watching, everyone, and have a great rest of your day.